Not much. Woke up, had breakfast, talked to the president. Uh, no, it was, of course, very a very unique experience. I mean, we've been here 10 years ago or so. Um, but it was a different atmosphere and we, you know, I was too new to, to be able to, to enjoy it as much as this time. Um, now getting to, to talk to the president and hear what he had to say about how he loved the way we played and how he respected us and it, it was impressive. Uh, so, yeah, yeah, it was uh, an important day. I'm going to ask you something I understand in green, and that is a president mentioning that this sort of selfless playing, the, the real team that's been put together, sort of being really noticed and without being looked at by other NBA teams, mm -hmm. is sort of a winning formula. What's your reaction? Uh, it's a great compliment. Uh, we, we we don't want to sound arrogant, but we heard it before, and it, it makes you feel really good uh, when, when when other coaches, when opponents, when a, a ref tells you, and then a president tells you, is you know it's great. So we we got to keep trying to to do it every day, not just once. Um, but I think it, it was a great tournament. It was a we played really well, and, and we. We get a, uh, an example to, to the whole league and other sports too. But now we got to do it again um, because if we do it once, we, we could have the chance to do it again. And, and we are trying to work hard to, to accomplish that again. How much of a motivating factor is meeting the president today in winning this, uh, another championship? Uh, uh, in my case, not much really. Uh, I mean, it's, it, this is a consequence. Of course, it, it's fun. I, I loved it. I, 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 I admire this guy. I, this president is, is of something of a very unique story, uh, you know, being uh, accomplishing what he did. But it's not that I go practice every day thinking that I may meet the president. I, you know, I, I practice hard because I want to, you know, win with my teammates. I want to end up uh, with another ring. Uh, and then if this happens, then it's another uh, good and good story to tell. But it's not a main uh, goal. Started an international player. Um, does it add to the significance to bring the, the most international roster in NBA history to the White House to meet the president? Does that add anything to it? Uh, well, he he mentioned it. I think it, it means something that to accomplish a goal, you don't always need to to look for the same uh, personnel. That you know, a lot of different personalities, backgrounds, um, stories can really blend together to, to accomplish something big. And, uh, and that's a great, um, a great thing that you can compare to, to other jobs and other situations. And he mentioned that too. So uh, I think it is a, a great example and we are all very proud of it. And now for women, Becky Hammond, what's that like? Uh, to tell you the truth, I, sometimes I hear things like that, that, you know, that how important it is for, for an NBA team too. But when we are playing and when we are practicing, we, we don't, look at her as a woman thinking, you know, different sex. She's a coach. And for us is, you know, her being a coach the same way as Coach Messina, as Coach Udoka, Coach Boylan. Uh, everybody's trying to push to, you know, uh, the ship the same way, uh, trying to accomplish the same goal. And it happens that she's a woman. Uh, and she's a very capable, smart and experienced uh, athlete. Uh, I, I didn't even try, so it was not part of my job, but uh, yeah, it's, it's not his style. The, the tie is not his thing. Just watching uh, you here meeting Obama today, lessen the blow of Messi losing Ballon d'Or today. Uh, you are very into Ballon I don't care at all, uh, to tell you the truth. I'm not a soccer guy, um, so I, I don't know, it's not an issue. I'm probably... Yeah, I'm pretty sure that they were more excited about uh, what you are talking about than what I did. Uh, but I think it still it's, it's a very unique uh, thing. It doesn't happen in, uh, every day that an Argentinian goes and, and meets the president of the United States. But uh, uh, yeah, soccer in my country is, is huge, not in, in my particular case, but uh, uh, usually whatever happens in the soccer world makes big news. Thanks, guys. Thanks, Manu.